Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for April 7th of 2022. Well, it is titled Messier 24 Sagittarius Star Cloud. So what do we see here? Well, this is one of the entries in Charles Messier's catalog of objects in the sky that were fuzzy through small telescopes, things that did not look like individual stars. Many of them were galaxies or star clusters or nebulae. However, in this case, we're actually looking at just a portion of our galaxy. And in fact, we're looking at a portion where the dust is a little bit less and we when we look towards the direction of the center of our galaxy. And that means that we see lots and lots of stars, because our galaxy has many billions of stars, and most of them we can't see because they're blocked out by dust. We do see a couple of dust patches here which block out the light from stars behind them. Otherwise, they would have just as many stars as the rest of the area. However, here, when we look at this star cloud, we can see the, the multitude of stars that exist in the direction of Sagittarius. So this is part of what we'd see as the Milky Way if we look out at night and we see that milky patch on the sky and you wonder what would it look like through a telescope? Well, here's an idea of what we would see. We would see that there are vastly more stars there than we can imagine. And the milky color is just that we don't see them as individual stars, but instead as a uh, just as all blurred together, kind of a river of milk running through the sky. And when we look at it in detail, we can in fact identify many, many stars here as we look through our uh, through our galaxy. Now, for the most part, we have a lot of dust towards the center of our galaxy. This is actually a gap in the dust clouds that we can see through. Most of the time that dust will block out the regions and keep us from being able to see a lot of what's going on. For example, at the center of our galaxy, also located in Sagittarius, we cannot see the center, even though it would should be incredibly bright, simply because there is so much dust between us and the center that it doesn't allow any visible light through. But here we look at one region where we can actually see and get a little bit of a glimpse as to what the regions toward the center of our galaxy actually look like. So that was our picture of the day for April 7th of 2022. It was titled Messier 24 Sagittarius Star Cloud. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.